Hey everybody, it's me, L Greenberg, with a quick video look at the Switch Easy Capsule Rebel Serpent case. I just received this case. I've never done a video of any kind, so bear with me. I just uh, haven't seen this case out there, and I thought I would uh, quickly shoot a video of it just so you guys could see what it's all about. Switch Easy gives you a lot of good stuff with their cases, uh, sort of the unboxing, if you will. They include a little small box with a bunch of stuff inside. First off, they give you a dock adapter so that you can use the phone in its case and any of your dock accessories like the dock, the cradle of any kind, or clock radio, etc. They give you a small video stand. You can watch movies uh, on the phone with this stand. I'll show you how that works when I have the case installed. They give you this little plastic dock adapter cover. It goes on the bottom of the phone and covers that port where your dock connector uh, attaches. For those of you that are concerned about dust particles and whatnot getting inside your phone, this port cover will prevent that from happening. They include two high quality screen protectors, clear variety. They include a cloth for cleaning your screen and a squeegee for installing those screen protectors. You also get a user's manual and instructions on how to install the case itself. Now let's go on, get on to the case. The case itself is a two-piece case. It consists of one softer, flexible plastic case, and then a second hard plastic that goes on the outside. What makes this unique different from the other Switch Easy cases is the serpent feature, which I guess is this snake skin like quality on the outside of this harder plastic piece. It definitely adds some grippiness to the case itself. The regular Capsule Rebel, which is identical to this case except for that serpent feature, definitely is uh, on the slicker side and I could see it easily slipping out of someone's hand, whereas this does offer some grippiness to it. To install the case, First, let me remove the case I've got on my phone right now. You first install the soft plastic piece by inserting the iPhone into it. I usually go into the top first and then just kind of wrapping it around the iPhone itself. Once that's installed, check to make sure that everything's lined up properly. The headset port looks good and the camera lens as well. You want to make sure that those are uh, completely open. And then the hard plastic piece goes around the outside. This is definitely a unique install. I wouldn't recommend this case to someone who, who likes to take their cases off every day or, or at night. It definitely takes a minute or two to install it. It's not a quick, quick two second install. I like to go into the top first and according to the instructions, you should go to the top first and then starting from the, the outside, work your way down to the bottom of the case, kind of clicking it into place as you go. You can hear, and I'll be quiet as I do this next one, you can hear it kind of click as I close it into place. And then the bottom too. And those kind of click as well. And there you have it, the case is installed. You can see that the new vibrate switch rather is completely accessible. The volume rocker buttons are covered but work just fine. On the top, the headset port is, is open and, and you can easily plug your headset in there. Whereas the power button is covered but once again works just fine and is, and is easily accessible. Here's that little dock port cover they provide that can slip in the bottom of the case. It only goes in one way. You gotta make sure you get it in right. And you can see that the microphone and speaker are still completely um, accessible and, and you have no problem hearing or speaking into uh, either one. Here's that video stand that I mentioned that works for if you wanna watch movies, you can kind of use it as a cradle to, to go into landscape mode and watch movies or videos on the iPhone itself. As for that dock we mentioned, again, I don't have a dock right here with me, but you can see that it easily slides in there and will sync on the, uh, through that on a, uh, on, on a dock that has removable inserts. So all in all, I like this case a lot. 
Um, I'll get to the positives first. It offers a good amount of protection. Once it's installed, it's really solid. There's no creaking of any kind. It really feels like it's meant to be part of the phone. Um, it's very tight and therefore it doesn't move around. It does offer, as I said, a good amount of protection. The grippiness on the back really aids in holding the phone, making sure it's not going to slip out of your hand. And again, they do provide a lot of, of stuff with their cases. The only negative that I'll say right now is this phone, this case does not seem to fit the phone 100% properly. You can see uh, in the bottom right-hand corner, there's a, a little bit of a gap, and it's and you can see the the skin portion of the case is visible. I'm not really sure why that is. You can you can see it here also. Uh, it's kind of off a little bit on the right-hand corner, where on the left hand it's completely flush, and that's causing it to kind of shift off to the right a little bit. And it just doesn't look like it's sitting on the phone 100% properly. Some people that might not bother. Uh, others, it probably will. It just it doesn't sit 100% right on the case. Uh, I'll have to get with Switch Easy and see if that's some kind of defect or, or what, or, or if all you know, I just happen to get one case that, that doesn't fit properly. But all in all, a really nice case. Again, Switch Easy does a great job. I ordered this case from SwitchEasy.com. It shipped quickly. I had it in a matter of days, three days, I think, coast to coast. So I really I can't say enough about their service, uh, enough good things about their service. If you want to check it out, check out switcheasy.com. If you have any questions, uh, find me on Howard Forums or send me a, a message somehow via YouTube, and uh, we'll go from there. Have a great day.